To reduce the stigma associated with being HIV positive, California reduced penalties on those who intentionally infect partners with the HIV virus against their knowledge. Can you change hearts and minds through legislation? Well, no, you, you can't. You can't also change morality that way. But understand what California did. California, it's no longer a felony, it's a misdemeanor to knowingly have sex with somebody when you're HIV positive and not inform them. It's no longer a felony, it's a misdemeanor. So, so regardless of what you think you can do with legislation, that's not the conversation. The conversation is how many people in California try to move to Indiana and how do we keep them out? How do we keep the crazy people who realize that their state is so crazy they can't live there anymore and they want to come here and make this state crazy because that's what happens. That's what happens with the American left. They, they're in Massachusetts, right? And they're like, oh, Massachusetts is great. Let's pass this law. Let's pass that law. Then they're like, wait a second. We, we have too many laws and life is terrible. We can't live here. They go to New Hampshire and then they try to destroy New Hampshire. We can't allow Californians to get out because when they do, my goodness, they get themselves into everything. I'm the last Californian who got to move uh, to Indianapolis. Don't let any more in. We need serious border security with Illinois and possibly with Kentucky. This, this shirt is like part vintage, part what you used to wear in the 70s on picture day, like the, the country shirt yeah, yeah. That, that mom put so you in. Pictures. I have got a lot of those. Um, <laughs> oddly enough, I actually am proud.